Hi, and welcome to the Lincoln Property Update, brought to you by Walters. You've been looking forward to your birthday meal for ages. A table's been booked at your favorite restaurant, and your best mates have got the date in their diaries. The night arrives, the menus are handed out, and there beside your spaghetti carbonara is the calorific couch showing exactly how many you're going to consume. And that's not including a starter and dessert to finish. That's because calorie labelling on menus was introduced in April this year, meaning that large restaurants, cafes and takeaway stores with 250 employees or more must provide the information. The government says that the new rules are part of a wider strategy to tackle obesity and are designed to help diners make a more healthy and informed choice. A survey commissioned by the software company Vita Mojo revealed that 68% of those polled believed that the new legislation was a good move and 57% agreed that calorie labelling would impact their food order. Research also shows that 48% of respondents already tracked are aware of their calorie intake and women and younger people are more likely to do so. While Beat, a leading UK charity that supports people with eating disorders, says that although they recognise the importance of reducing obesity, anti-obesity campaigns that focus on weight instead of health are counterproductive and can cause distress. For anyone who prefer not to see calorie counts, restaurants are allowed to offer a menu without the information, but it's not a legal requirement and may not always be an option. And for those who want to know more about the food they're about to eat, the new law may make people think twice about the choices they make. Enjoying a good meal is without doubt one of life's pleasures. So how many of us will be counting calories the next time we dine out? Thanks so much for watching. Please like and subscribe to all our channels to keep up to date with everything property in your area.